Hitler is the most murderous dictator has ever seen. Hitler is the personification of evil. He contributed the king of 60 million people in the Second World War. He is responsible for the murder of 6 million Jews in genocide. The story of demonic man and his transformation into the most murderous dictator the world has ever seen. Some described him as psychopaths and others as a crazy serial killer. You can imagine that this thug occupied 11 countries. Hitler is considered one of the most controversial figures on the 20th century, if not the most. And let's tell his story from the beginning. But before all that, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and follow the video to get everything new. Hitler was born in 1889 in Austria. Austria and Germany were one country called the Austrian German Republic after the First World War. And his father was a fanatic who treated him violently all the time. And no one was sorry for him except his mother Carla. He loved her to the point of madness and until the last day of his life had her picture in his wallet. Hitler was a failure in the school and he left the school at the age of 16 taking his suitcase traveling to Vienna stronghold of the arts and began painting and selling his landscapes then he presented in the largest educational edifice in the world the Academy of Fine Artists in Vienna but he was rejected after he preferred to move from the home of homeless and unemployed selling his panties in hope of living at that time Jews were in the control of all trade in Vienna from the serious transaction to the point of buying panties at the lowest cost and then reselling them for the largest sum and this what was happening with Hitler so they were fixing him and degrading the levels of his drawing and all this in order to take them cheaply. This contributes the hatred of Jews in a big way, as we will see after a while. The important thing is that after two years of struggle and displacement, he went bankrupt and didn't find his daily sustenance. He decided to return to his hometown in Germany. When he came back, his mother had a cancer. A month later, she did at the age of 47. And seriously, it was one of defining moments for Hitler. And if you notice, you always will see in his picture the look of sadness. His personal photographer, Henrik Hoffman, said that he had never seen anyone so sad like him because he had lost his mother and her dead was the first nucleus of his intense hatred of Jews because the Jewish doctor who treated her Edward the Balch injected her with the wrong dose of Enfarm and this was the improvement treatment for cancer after his aunt raised him and after her death he inherited some money from her he decided to go back to Vienna in hopes of joining the Institute of Painting. But he was again rejected in 1913. He fled Astoria to Munich in fear of forced conscription. But he was arrested. After the revelation, they decided that he wasn't fit for the military because of his poor physical nature. A year later, in 1914, the First World War broke out. In this time, he volunteered in the military and he took the first lines. This war has two strong effects on his body. It will stay with him all his life. He was sharpened in that sensitive area between his sides that caused him sexual problems. And there was a song that English and Russian were singing. Hitler has only one test tube. And the second effect was his line under his nose, his short mustache that will stay with him all his life. After that, it became a fashion during his role. Now let's go to the important time of Hitler's life, the First World War. Hitler was fighting bravely for his love of Germany to the extent that when the war finished 
He was awarded cardiac medal in 1918. He was hospitalized at this time. He received the news of Germany's surrender and the signing is the famous treaty of Versailles which was Germany's burial and he was shocked to the extent that contributed on his madness and his crazy behavior to the end of his life at that time he decided to enter the political life but let me to tell you the real reasons of hating Jews bitterness of defeat was dominate on German people as the Jews take the advantage of the war of psychological defeat so they were the first to introduce all the kind of prostitution to Berlin and jumbling to narcotic balls to the point of creating a theater of adultery in the center of Berlin they send to bring all the women from French. They were explosive phenomenon and they promoted the freedom of homosexuality and they encouraged it. I want to tell you, my friend, by the passage of all these years, the Jews were conscientious and their bad heritage is still in Berlin until now. In addition, they were completely occupied with banks because of their involvement in a serious transaction. All of this increased Hitler's anger at the situation of German in general and from the Jews in particular. He joined the German Workers' Party, which was literally named the Nazi Party. And because of Hitler was an active and hard-working orator and the loud orator, he was in just two years the head of the party come to the year of 1923 in which the inflation and the high prices reached their highest level hitler took the advantage of the situation to enlist the dismissal of government and arranged a small cop so he gathered a few men of people with muscles from the party men and called them the storm forces or the militia of brown shirts by the way this will be the military shield of the party and they surprised the governor of bavaria while he was meeting in the park and told him to dissolve of the government or you will be killed immediately and he had nothing to do and they forced him to agree the next day hitler addressed the people and they brought with him 3000 people and went out in the demonstration that ended with their arrest and hitler was thrown out in the prison that was the important period in his life because he spent all nine months in reading and wrote his famous book Mein Kampf which sold nine million copies Hitler was convinced that there no way to the power except the election and by the year 1929 it came with a surprise it's the collapse of Wall Street in New York because of this, America demanded that Germany pay off its debts and the economy has worse more than it was. Hitler took the advantage and began to make the influential meeting and the speeches everywhere telling them that he had the solution to Germany's problem to the point that he gave the 10 speeches daily and indeed succeeded with the majority in parliament and the Nazi party was tasked with forming the government in which Hitler was the head of the government night long knives Hitler's enemy after the Jews were the communist Russian and in 1934 he befriended fate so when parliament building was burned he took it as a seed and accused them being the reason and convinced the president to dissolve with the communist parties then the dictatorial law called empowerment act was drafted 
which gives it to the government the absolute power to enact laws without submitting them to parliament for approval and here it is the first appearance of Hitler's ugly face he kept behind the opposition parties closing their headquarters and the newspapers and whoever object puts him in the prison even if he doesn't object he throws him in the prison as well and within months he succeeded in tightening his grip on the legislative authority as well as the executor not only that even the opponents within the Nazi party began to liquidate all of them outside the framework of the law in one night and almost at the same hour in precise colonization and this operation is famous for the long knives because they were killing them by knives the beginning of a real legend of Hitler in 1934 President von Hundberg did and Hitler become for her and because he is a smart dictator he knows that is the most important thing he had to do was to win the people that is why he did three things to improve their standards of living from six million unemployment he could reach them to zero the German economy has rebounded dramatically after they couldn't make a bullet except in the secret place and on a small scale because of the Treaty of Versailles he started to establish arms factories all over Germany and this contributed to the elimination of unemployment the second need which is media and its captivity on the minds he was keen to choose the smallest details by himself such as the best position for his photo and the pictures that land in the street he was filming him in all situations and answering a group of people showing them his picture and giving a reward to everyone who made a mistake or a good opinion in his choice of his picture to the extent that from the madness of determination and extreme narcissism he used to stand in front of the mirror for hours practicing speeches the last thing that he could eliminate the prostitution he closed all brothels and denounced sexually abused guys for the purpose of people should leave the fun and go to work at the same time he encouraged the woman and increased the important continental people after the people had their stomach and minds full the way is paved for hitler to begin his real domination after hitler had the power in 1933 he gave his speeches in berlin to the people and told them something that everyone mocked him which he told them that give me four years and i pledge to change germany and make it a great country and also pledge that the level of unemployment will be zero so let's see what he did his enemy testifies to him that the move he made to german is a miracle by all standards his first goal to raise the standard of living of germany's person so he appointed one of the most articles in history of germany the Bertelsberg and told him i want to build a bridge and a network of highways connecting the wall of germany i want the people to come back to love the country he ordered the establishment of garden parks and playgrounds in every neighborhood and street in germany so that people can be happy after that he wanted to make a car he asked the most brilliant engineer to attend and the choice was made by Ferdinand Porsche the famous of Volkswagen and Porsche factories he told him that I want a hundred percent German car with God size and the familia and all that for sheep 
and told him, I will guarantee you the sale of thousands of cars in one month. And asked someone and told him, forget about the treaty of Versailles and start to build the military factories. We want to have our weapons and the foods after Germany was without naval forces and have almost 100,000 soldiers without airmen. Now they have 2,800 arms factories where 72,000 of workers were employed after they were 4,000 only before the start of his rule. But we have the question, how can this country have the money for everything to spend on factories and roads. My friend, I want to tell you that this man was honest in his desire to increase the Germans' income and their living standard. He needed refreshing solutions that doesn't harm the people. He appointed an economist. Dr. Schacht. He is considered as the economical mind in the humanity. And he told him that, Doctor, I spent four billions in building and repairs. Find me a solution, but doesn't include no increase in taxes. There is no lifting of subsidies on goods and the services. And don't say foreign loans. Dr. Schacht proved that he is a real doctor. So he started a thing that called me for bonds. And these bonds with high interest that the depositor get back after five years. Since Hitler proved that he is a man who kept his promises. People increased their confidence in him. And the people came to buy these bonds that reached 21 billions. And one of the strange things that increased his popularity, that he speeches to the people and told them that the woman has only her house and her husband and the duty of husband is to work and the duty of the woman is to devote herself and her family and reproduction and he gives the honor every woman has four child in this year German recorded the highest birth rate in its history. You know my friend what happened? The workers came back to the work. And after the unemployment where 6 million believes that became zero. And not only that, there was a shortage of 50,000 workers. And that increased the salaries. Of course the people stopped playing. And as a result of that, Crime rate decreased in a way that never happened in Germany and the child mortality dropped because women became more interested in their child as women have time to decorate their wives became more beauty and German machines burst into flames to achieve their goals effectively as a result Germany has the highest rate this year by 8 times that didn't happen in its history my friend i want to tell you that we have finished today but the complete of the story will be tomorrow don't forget to give me a like and subscribe in my channel and i want to tell you be my friend thank you for watching and very thanks for your time have a good day and bye